good old RC Bills up here, eh? With another episode of Build the Trailers, boys. Hey, why wouldn't I? Freaking right. So anyways, like you've seen in the other videos, there I built the daughter trailer I did. And look at that, boys. I got her painted today, I did. I got to still fix the tires and stuff, but that's freaking decent, boys. Hey, eh? I didn't get too crazy away with sand her down and stuff because it's just, you know... It's just going to get dirty anyways. It's an RC boat trailer, for God's sakes. So I want to do the same thing I did on mine and just put a little Velcridge on there. Why wouldn't I? Velcridge, boys. Hey? Bell old cridges. I will. Freaking right, I will. You have to order some more Velcro, boys. I'm going to take some of this into the old bedroom, too. Why wouldn't I, hey? Why the hell wouldn't I? So anyways, we'll stick this on here like this, boys. Hey, like this. Why wouldn't we? Little tapey, tapey. There we go, hey? There's one. Hey, there's one. Freaking right. Why wouldn't it be? Cut that off like that. We'll stick her down real good like that. We'll take the old blade like this. We'll find the edge of the metal like that. And we'll go, hey, boys. Hey, boys. Decent. Now we'll do the other side. The same. Decent and decent, boys. There we go. That was freaking easy, wasn't it? So now we'll trim the edges. <laughs> trim the edges, boys. Girls. Peoples. No, you want to be easy, careful, gentle when you're using the razor blade too, eh? Bill's tip of the day. Be careful when you're using a razor blade because she'll cut you. She will. Freaking right it will. Wouldn't be the first time I sliced my finger open with a razor blade, boys. Frig no. But they do work good for this kind of stuff they do. Freaking right it does. Look at it. Grab a holder. And just go. Freak yeah. Decent. So there you go. There's that part done. And uh, now we just need to put a little bit on the nose cone like it did on the other one there. We're going to have to go long ways on this one, boys. Long ways. This one's longer than mine. Why wouldn't it be? Why the hell wouldn't it be, boys? So we'll get this in there like that. And then we'll take my little doodad like this. And we'll push it into the corner like that. And then we'll go, eh? There you go, boys. Decent. So now we just gotta trim that off, we do. Friggin' right we do. Why wouldn't we? Boys. Boys. Girl. Almost like I knew what I was doing or something. Almost like I knew what I was doing, boys. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't, eh? Friggin' right. There's one side, now we gotta do the other side. So we'll trim around the corner here, we'll do a little lap, like that. And then we'll take it like this, we'll do another little lap like that and then we'll take this and we'll go down boys down and then up boys hey and then up down and up boys there it is look at that that's freaking decent now the boat should slide right on there it should like a glove hey like a glove bo oh boys does that ever feel good oh that's freaking decent there you go boys there's the old daughter's trailer it is. Friggin' right, and the boat sits on there just perfect too. I don't know if you can see that or not. Look how nice and perfect that boat sits on there. Friggin' right it does. So that's how you do it, boys. Just use some Velcro, and then you don't scratch the bottom of your boat, eh? Frig no. So anyways, that's that one. I got something else to show you I did too, eh? Why wouldn't I? So we'll put this up here, like so. This up here like so, boys, like so. So what I did, Yesterday off camera because I'm sure you get tired of me building trailers, but I want to show you this. Built another trailer I did. So my daughter's pretty smart. She is. She's a smart little girl. And she says to me, Daddy, when we're running our RC, when we're driving our RCs with the boats behind them, how are we going to carry the remotes and stuff for the boats and all the batteries if we're driving the car? I said, I don't know, honey. So I built myself another trailer idea, eh? So we got this trailer here we do. And this one. Look at that, boys. Look at that thing roll. Oh, my God. Look at it. Freaking rolls decent, that one. And I already pulled it around, and the Traxxas does pull both trailers, it does. So this trailer goes on the truck, and then the boat goes behind it, because this is heavier, so if I put the boat in the middle, it'll just flip the boat over. So we're gonna use this one, and we'll load her up, and it holds a remote. Hey, there's a boat remote, boys. One boat, two boat, hey. Decent. And it holds all my batteries, boys, hey. Look at all them batteries, boys. Holy. I just have a few, eh? Not too many, just a few batteries, boys. Hey, why wouldn't I? So there you go, look at, they all fit in there. Those are out in the box still, but they all fit, boys. And she, oh, it makes great weight too. Like it's almost perfectly balanced like that. Friggin' right. Now I won't carry that many friggin' batteries and stuff when we go, of course, I'll only bring one or two. So that's just showing you how much weight she holds, which is too much, boys. Can't run that many light bulb batteries in the old trailer, boys. It's just too much weight. So that's pretty decent. I get that all painted up, get the fenders done on that thing, and then she'll be Bob's your uncle. Friggin' right it will be. Bob's your uncle all the way down the street, boys. Right? Friggin' right. So that turned out pretty decent. 
I should go in the business of building RC boat trailers. Why wouldn't I? Put your orders in, boys. Hey, put your orders in and we'll get some trailers going, we will. Friggin' right, we will. I got some extra metal left over, so we'll see what happens, eh? Friggin' right. Maybe make some of those little trailers they use for all the uh, rock crawlers, eh? Those trailers would be simple to make. They're so small. Friggin' right, they would. You supply me the, the stuff, the tires that you want on it, and I'll uh, see what I can do, eh? Why wouldn't I? Maybe. Maybe. Text me first, and then we'll decide, right? Anyways, there's another trailer, boys. She only weighs like 50 pounds or so. So it should be no problem, eh? No problem to pull that thing around. So now that I got my bench all dirty again, I just cleaned it off. Cause I had it outside. And I got all wet and dirty and crappy boys. There we go, eh? Decent. Nothing like some air, boys. I haven't drained that compressor in I don't know how long. Probably full of water. Oh, decent. I had a valve on it, but it broke off. Why wouldn't it break off? We'll do that on the weekend, we will. It'll be a weekend job, boys. Freaking right it will be. But anyways, I wanted to show you that trailer and I'll show it to, again to you there when I uh, get the old fenders mounted on it, I will. Freaking right I will. But uh, not too much going on today at all. Not too much going on at all, hey? I had a couple, uh, I pounded out a couple videos today I did. So we'll see what happens. We'll see if this is any freaking good. Probably just a piece of junk video it is. But hey, it is what it is. Oh, I gotta call the old Tim. I gotta call you, Tim. Get that steel table so you can weld on something, eh? I didn't forget about you. I just unburied your card there and I seen it, so I figured I'd remind you. Bring it into work and drop it off, eh? Why wouldn't you? Come on, buddy. Friggin' right you should. That way I won't forget, eh? Decent. But anyways, hopefully everybody had a good day and didn't do anything I didn't do, and uh... You know what to do for now.